Oh, well, hello there, neighbor. I mean, okay, I'm sorry. I'm not gonna do that. <clears throat> hey, what's up, guys? All right, so <laughs> Yang Bing back. I'm gonna just uh, first off say I love making my modded weapons videos, guys. It's so much fun. But oh, dude, it's so hard trying to keep up with all the updates and all the mods I'm trying to show off, and then make a video, and then the game updates. Ugh, it's just it's too much for me to handle sometimes. So I'm just gonna take it easy and show you guys something new. So the game currently is in update seven in its beta, but it's also in beta of its betas. If that makes sense. So, I think right now it's U7, or Update 7, Beta 11. It was actually Beta 10 this morning, but we already know what that was about, right, Cosby? Gotcha. Alright, anyway, uh, there's some new things about U7 in general that I think some people have shown off already, but I didn't get to say my piece about U7 yet. So, what I'm going to show you guys today is some of the new features, some of the new weapons, more or less. But really, the features and kind of just explore them with you guys. I haven't played them too much, so I'm not like an expert on them. I'm just going to show you guys um, how everything kind of happens and we'll dissect this thing together. Alright, let's go make a video, guys. So yes, we're going to be playing this in first person view, which I normally do just for like highlights in my modded videos. But this time, I'm just going to show you guys some good action and talk about these new features in the game. And, you know, it's so funny when people are talking about baby hands. I kind of see it, but it's kind of look like my real hands. Anyway, alright, so we're going to do about, I think we'll do five weapons, kind of demonstrate them, and then see how the new feature incorporates them. I'm going to do the spear, that's one. Yeah, we'll try out the dagger. Actually, put on this hand. Do the short sword. This is kind of a new one. It's, it, I would say like it replaces the or the old broadsword we had. So it actually, I like this one more. It looks a bit better. And then, oh yeah. So these are a mod that uh, I got from, oh shit. That I got from Drags, the uh, mod maker. If I can pull them out, there we go. Look how shiny these things are. Hey Drags, I'm gonna show them off right now. Well actually no, I'm, I'm showing them off right now. But I'm not showing them off yet. So, I'm gonna show off the baby axe since everyone thinks it's such a baby axe. It's actually pretty good, guys. And then I need one more. Hmm. One more. Ah, okay. Yeah, I like this. This is one of those new weapons, too, guys. It's those wrist blades. So, I'm actually gonna do dual wrist blades. No, actually, no, I'm not. The new system that we got here, which I'll show you, is right here in the book. This is this new symbol. You know, a couple things come to mind. It looks like Laurel Reefs, you know, kind of like a Caesar, like, woohoo, look at you, you're gladiator champion. What it shows us are scores. Check this out. All right, so we got experience points, honor points, and kills, hits, received, score. That's the big one. All right, because you guys know me. Damn, that's so shiny. Ah, it's distracting. Ah! So, you guys know me, I'm all big about challenges and what all that, so these, this score thing right here, that's one thing I'm going to be loving when this update actually comes out or when I can understand how this all works. But the cool thing is that the kill history, we'll be able to see, you know, what, I love how this says creature, not just humans, so maybe we'll get something, you know, other than half naked people running around. So we got creatures, the NPCs, the style of their kill. That's one thing we're gonna learn today. Like what what are the different styles? And also the experience points and honor. What kind of kill gives us what experience points and how much honor? I don't know how this really works out, but that's what we're gonna be finding out together. What we're gonna do, I'm actually gonna switch hands. Oh, there we go. And we're just gonna do this real easy wave one. And the way I'm going to do this, I'll start that. I'm going to hold out my book, all right? So we're going to be able to see exactly what happens, all right? Contestant number one, come on down. Oh, and he's a feisty one. I'm going to kill this guy, and we're going to see what it tells us. All right, human, Pierce, 
and look, 54 experience points and one honor. And translates right over here. Oh, and the experience points is the score. Oh, that's cool. It's kind of funny, you know, I stabbed them directly in the eyeball. And apparently that's very honorable. Not a lot of experience points that I thought it and magic would happen. So what happens if I get him right in the sweet spot? Well, not not the exact sweet spot I was referencing. Alright, no honor, 58 experience. I'm trying to go for like right in the chest. Even less experience points. And okay, that's weird. The head stab only was 54, but it was the most honorable. So, hey, you know, right in the right in the eye, right in the brain. Very honorable kill, I guess. Oh, still alive. Oh, okay, so it looks like... <laughs> I think everybody was saying that if you kill somebody on the ground, it's bad juju. So, <laughs> negative 2 honor, but 54 experience points, so maybe 54 is the head. We'll confirm with this guy. Is your head worth 54 points? Slash, head, neck. Yeah, okay. Let's take note, guys. Heads consistently for three times is 54. Alright, so I just killed this guy for 50 points. Stabbed him in the chest, but also punched my wall. So, I'm not going to show you guys that. And I think somebody just hit me. Yep, okay. So, let's see. That's the head, the body. What about the knees, huh? Everybody loves the knees. Thanks, PewDiePie, for that. <laughs> Alright, so... I guess that counts as... Oh, he's still alive! 58 points for torso kill. Negative 3 points, because I guess I killed you on the ground. Sorry. So, that was a nice breakdown. Ah, check this out, guys. This was interesting. 363 experience points. Negative 3 honor. But my score, 348. So what's that? 15 minus points? So if that's 15 minus points, how did that happen? Negative 3, negative 2, 5, with one hit. So maybe one hit is 10. That adds up. So a hit is negative 10 points, and then each time you lose honor, that's a total. So that's not the total. That's the total for all my honor, but this is the total for negative points. So maybe that was negative 15 points. Interesting system you got, Cosby. Let's test it out some more. Alright, so started the wave over again, and we're back to a clear slate. This guy, he's got the baby axe! Alright, so let's do baby axe versus baby axe. Oh, chill, homie. Let's see how much a decapitation is worth. Hey, check it out! 64 points and 2 honor. Let's see if I can do it again. Yo, we're baby axe friends. Touch tips? Alright, so slash, head, neck, 46. Last time it was 54, right guys? But that was just pierce. So, come on, I want consistency. Consistency, friend. Lovely. 75! Wow, okay, so I don't know what I'm doing better or different, but I think I'm, that's what I'm saying. The experience points, honor system, it's... Uh, I don't understand it yet, but I will. I will. Thank you, Cosby, for putting it in. This is going to be really exciting. And let's just go ham on these guys real quick. None? No style. <laughs> Glitch! I feel my baby axe. Fine, I sacrifice it. So, just a little rampage right there. No style, no style. No negative experience points though, so... Go, go rampage and I guess it's not bad. There was one thing I wanted to try though, so I'm just gonna reload this real quick. With the axe. And, oh shit, my axe is gone. Alright, so there's one thing with the axe that I was gonna do. I totally forgot. That will carry it away. But how much is, like, a tomahawk kill? You know, so if I put this right in between this guy's eyes. Go ahead, swing. Oh, oops. Swing again, please. There we go. Oh, look. Slash head thrown. I'll take that. 
Hey! So, there's no way for me to tell these points yet. Like I said, guys, we'll figure it out. But I'm gonna test out these other weapons and see what kind of points we can do. Dagger. Let's go. Uh, Pierce torso 50. Pierce head. Oh, but it kind of throw. Whoa, negative three. Ah, get up. Don't lay on the ground, making me look bad. Oh my gosh, look, negative four for smash. Yikes. All right, so clearing the board again, guys. We've got the sword. What we're going to try to do this time is do some dismemberments and decaps. Well, we already saw decaps. So let's work these dismemberments. I forgot, this is also a tutorial. I had it. Fall on it too while you're at it. Jeez. All right, so I'm gonna teach you guys a little bit how to fight with these weapons. A lot of people say like, when I swing my sword, it just slaps them, you know? Well, just because you're probably hitting with the flat of the blade. Make sure in this game. That's why I love this game so much. Wrist alignment is very important. So I'm gonna show you guys how to properly decap, dismember, and you know, be a badass with the swords in the game. All right, so. I'm gonna take your leg. Don't mind me, okay? Good. Swing though. Come on. There we go. Alright. Wrist alignment is everything, guys. No style. Dismemberment. 57. A bass, dog. Clean. Lovely. Just like that guys, it's very easy. I don't know how I got 24 points on that one, but sometimes it is what it is. Ah, messed up that one. And yes, I'm playing on default physics guys, so there's nothing to it. It's really just practice and wrist alignment. I'll show the book in a bit, but I need two hands for this one. I'm gonna do a little spear action, alright? Let's see if that shows up on the book. <laughs> Call me either the toe popper or the farmer. <laughs> Come on. Hoeing away at these feet. And that's not what I want it to sound like. There we go. We'll check the book later. Oh, you God damn it. I needed to check kick kills two. <laughs> Lucky. Wow, that almost got her. Yeah, better do it. Alright guys, last little combo with the spear. <laughs> nice. Let's check what the book says now. Ooh, look, spear throw, 72 points. I think that might be the highest I've seen. So, looks like throwing, and that just hit his chest. I guess that's the cleanest and best way to score. Ooh, that's probably when I kicked that guy in the head. Sorry. Ah, but check this out, guys. 336 experience, negative one honor. But the score is still 336. Maybe I didn't get hit, that's why. Alright, maybe one more round guys, just so I can show that off. Alright, so I know I've just been doing wave one, I'm very easy. It's nothing too impressive guys. It's not like, oh my god, you took on like 12 dudes, ah. We're just trying to see what these features do, and how to read them. So, I'm gonna start up wave one. I'm gonna try to do a pretty clean level, but then let them hit me a few times to see if we can't deduct the points and figure out how this works. But, to make it a little bit interesting, Everybody likes a good little Kima type style. So, let's see if I can uh, Kima this up for you.
Last two guys. I'm gonna kill this dude. And then let him hit me a few times. Ah, <sighs> Cospy, sometimes your game makes me rage. As I was saying, I'm gonna let this guy hit me a few times. Right here. Don't be shy. No, right here. Ow. Okay. That's uh one hit. Uh, let's do three hits. One more time. Okay. Come on. Batter up, boy. Right, right here. See the face? Hit the face. Okay, that counts as four. Now you die. Yeah. <clears throat> Alright guys, so let's take a look at the book right here. The score I got is 343 and then minus 7, well 70, because I think it's negative 10 per hit. So 70 minus 343 is 273. All right, so 273 minus six. Nope, nope, that's not right. Minus four, five. So minus nine, nine total negative honor. So 273 minus nine is 254. Ah, okay, imagine that. So that system kind of works. I like that. Um, how the points are dictated, I don't know. Well, anyway, guys, thanks for stopping by. Uh, it's very interesting where the point system's gonna go with this game. I know Cosby's got like procedural worlds, armor, and I think money too for like buying different weapons and armor. The weapons too, they're on a tier system. Maybe I should mention that in another video. Well, guys, again, thanks for stopping by. I'm Yang Bang, and I'll see you in the next video. Peace out, guys.